Steve Everett. How you doing? I'm doing good. I'm in Ann Arbor. Could, <laughs> could you get better than that? Glad to have you back. And you come back every, I mean, not just for, for this. You come back, you're at games. We see you all the time. Uh, but talk about why you come back for this okay, in particular. Um, I mean, just what the guys have been saying all day. We listened to some of the guys earlier on the radio today. And it's just um, you, when you realize how little it takes to make someone's day and you know if we go to the hospital and you see a hundred kids like you start maybe a couple of those kids you know the faces start to look the same and and but what's coming from there and like that family you're in there for five minutes and that's like making their day for like the whole year that's a story this little kid's gonna have for you know the rest of his life so you know when you realize just just how little it really takes to you know put a smile on a kid's face you know, why wouldn't you want to step, step up? I'm going to go help? back to that well really quick as we head to break. I want to give you some time to ponder this this question. Uh, Notre Dame backing out of a series with Michigan. Uh, Brady Hoke had some, some things to say about it a little bit. He said uh, he felt like it was maybe an example of some, some chicken behavior. I'm curious, what are Steve Everett's thoughts on that? Like I needed another reason <laughs> to hate Notre Shame. <laughs> They're embarrassing. It's a joke. Their whole existence is, I don't know, it's just a sham. And from Manti Teo to Michigan State's greatest game ever when they tied each other in 65 or whatever that was. I hate them both. I could care less if anything, some horrific disaster happened to their campus. Good. Um... <laughs> Charlie Weiss, the best thing that happened when he was there, remember, I mean, one of the greatest things I ever saw on a sideline was when Charlie Weiss got taken out by, on the sideline and his, like, his back of his foot touched his head. I mean, just little things like that, you know, stick with you. You know what? We get that on purpose you know, to get Weiss on the sidelines. You, you, you gotta, you gotta appreciate a guy that's consistent. I think your, uh, your guys' ratings just went up. Yeah, a yeah, guy that's consistent. Well, we that are gonna the give you what you ask for. That is Steve Everett for you.